What is up, Poke Peeps and Masters? This is Russ, your Poke Russ here. We are back for the Pokemon Silver U Lock, the first U Lock on YouTube, probably. I don't know. I don't know. I keep claiming that I might have made it, but I don't know if I did. I've, I've taken a lot of different things from different places and kind of just, um. You say I just traded. I just traded my best Pokemon to the guy beside me. Huh? The Pokemon I got was holding something. Okay, so I wanted to check this out, uh, I wanted to check this out and see if there was anything that I got from doing this. I don't know if there is. I feel like the, uh, there's the, I remember talking to the guy that was, okay, he's not in here. He's not in here. Let's go back out and see if we can find, I know exactly where he is. We talked to him before. I think I might have said no when you're supposed to say yes, and he takes you over here and he's like, blah, 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 blah. He might give you the quick claw. I don't know. Another quick claw. I think the Quick Claw is actually in... Oh. Okay. Hello, are you a trainer? Did you, did you battle the gym leader? Did you win? No. Is that so? Then you're supposed to... Okay. So this guy... This is the guy take that takes you. He's very uh, flamboyant. Here, teacher. I am. Good <laughs> it is to study here. So he's taking a lesson from uh, Master Yoda. So if I followed you back, did did give me any knowledge? Earl I am. Wonderful are Pokemon, yes. I teach you I teach you I will to be a better trainer. I can't even give this guy a voice because I can't I can't speak him. I can barely speak normal trainer speak. What you want to know, what you want a winner you will be, yes. Because I will teach you in Pokemon Battles. Okay. Okay, okay I don't want to hear anything else from you. Okay. You know, I, I doubt you give me anything, so... I doubt, I doubt, I doubt. So let's get into this gym battle. Um, let me go make sure I have enough potions and everything. Welcome, bye. Um, I'm gonna buy four potions, so I don't know how many I have. It's actually gonna break, break me, it's going to break me. Hmm. Oh well, okay. Luckily my mother has some money saved up somewhere for me. But let's take on this gym challenge. Uh, who do we have up front? Tom Fan. Let's let's lead with, keep leading with Tom Fan because I do kind of kind of want to keep switch training him. The key word is guts. Those here are training night and day to become bird masters. Come on. Bum 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 bum. They should have moved Bird Keeper Toby into here, because he's definitely a bird master, probably. Okay, so here's a Pidgey. We're going to Tom Fan, who literally can't do anything. I mean, he can Hypnosis. So let's go into Ty, our nice Quilava. I forgot it evolved in the last episode. So Wednesday, this will be the last episode for this section of the game. So before Tuesday afternoon. Vote. Vote for who you want to see added to the squad next, um, in the next upcoming routes, and we'll gun for it in the next episode. And let me know, uh, guys, let me know in the comment section how you think I should evolve Tom Fan. Should I, should I evolve it, like, as soon as I can? Because actually, their level up movesets are the exact same as Haunter and Gengar. So, I mean, I could have a Gengar early, but is it, do you guys consider that cheating? How do you want me to handle that? Ty's attack missed. Ah, this sand attack is ruining my Christmas. There we go. I've gotten a handful of votes already, cause so hype to you guys. And there goes the Pidgey. So he defeated Bird Keeper Rod. I love when uh, people were actually able to make like uh, YouTube names and stuff like this based on like the, the games they super like, like Pokemon stuff like that, like Bird Keeper Toby, um, and stuff like that. Like me, I'm Poke Ross. I obviously come from the term Poke Ross, which is first introduced in this gen. Actually, I believe I'm 96 percent sure. I might be wrong. It might, might be wrong. Pokeros might have been introduced in 3rd gen. I feel like I should know more. I feel bad for not knowing more. 
da, 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 da. Um, we might sneak over to the Ruin of Alice after this. Um, do a little puzzling there, and f finish off the episode like that. I'll also, look at this. This is an, a blatant money sign. Is that what the gyms are? To, is this what the gym is to this guy? Okay. I am Falkter, the Violet's Pokemon Gym Leader. People say that you can clip flying-type Pokemon's wings with a jolt of electricity. I won't allow such insult to birdie Pokemon. I will show you my real power of my magnificent bird Pokemon. Okay, Faulkner wants to battle. Faulkner sends out Pidgey. Okay, so we are going to Hypnosis this thing. Hit it right off the bat, because we don't want to be hit with those um pesky, pesky sand attacks. I also didn't see what level this was, because uh, in this game you can't see the level after you put to sleep. Interesting note. Or any status condition, actually. So we're going to go with a nice ember here. Critical hit. I don't know if we needed that. We probably needed it. Next is going to be Pidgeotto. So what is levels is Pidgeotto? Level 9. See, this is what I was talking about. I'm like, this is, this is absolutely bupkis. The levels in this game are absolutely a joke. I could probably lower these guys' levels to two lives apiece and probably still not lose one. Like, I am, like, literally, Miltank is my only concern throughout this entire game. And there's level 15 for Ty. Six levels above. <laughs> Both my Pokemon are at least one level above the leader of this guy. <laughs> Alright, take this. It's the official Pokemon leader is Zephyr Badge. Okay. Raise the attack power. Oh, it enables the Pokemon to use Flash. Here, take this too. So we received TM31, which I believe is Mud Slap. Yep, Mud Slap. Okay. It's both offensive and defensive. So that. We, we pre pretty much took down the Gym Leader pretty quickly. A little bit quicker than I originally expected. So let's go over to the Ruin of Alves and check that place out before we. Oh, I forgot we had to do this. Hello! Hello, Pokeros! We discovered something about the egg. My assistant is waiting at the Pokemon Center in Violet City. Could you could you talk to him? Click. So we're gonna go with this nice little egg here. Pokeros, long time no see. Professor Elm asked me to find you. He has another favor to ask. Would you take care of this Pokemon egg? We discovered that a Pokemon will not hatch until it grows in the egg. It also needs to be active with other Pokemon to hatch. Pokeros, you're the only person we can rely on. Please call Professor Elm when it when this egg hatches. Okay, so we're not gonna we're not gonna go into the next routes or anything because you guys still have voting time. You have till tomorrow afternoon to vote because that's when I'm gonna be recording the episode for Wednesday. Uh, so Tuesday afternoon. So let's go check out the Rune of Alves, do some puzzle solving. Um, I'm 90, I'm like, at this point I'm 90% sure none of you guys are going to choose Unknown, but, I mean, you guys could. And it's not like I have to catch the first version of the Pokemon I see, it's just I have to catch the Pokemon you guys want me to. Audrey is blocking the way to get to Goldenrod City, preventing me from shopping, something should be done about it. Hey! I was going to snap that tree with my straight-up punching arms, but I couldn't. I'm a failure. <laughs> so we got the nice little pseudo widow. Look at this little wiggling thing. <laughs> Did you see that strange tree in the road? Okay, so let's go ahead down to the Ruin of Alves. The ruins are over 1,500 years old, it is not, but it is not known why they were built, or by whom. 
There's an odd pattern drawn on the walls of the Ruin of Owls. They must be the key to unraveling the mysteries of the ruins. This doesn't seem to work yet. Hmm. So let's go in here and sol let's do some puzzle solving. Welcome to this chamber. There are sliding panels that depict a Pokemon drawn by ancients. Slide the panels around to form a picture. Uh, then right to the right of the, is a description of the Pokemon. A Pokemon that hidden on the sea floor. Its eyes are black, scanning for the area. So this should be the Kabuto, right? Yeah, so this should be the Kabuto. So let's do some puzzling, because we puzzle good here. Actually, we're gonna use not use the this because this, this makes it easier. We'll put that there. This is the other eye. They can put that there. This goes here. This goes here. Yep. That's gonna go right down here. And... Yup, and... Nice and Kabuto! The floor drops out from under me! There's a strange presence here. See how many puzzles we can actually activate now. So I think this, this one actually activates A through K. I don't even know what a shiny unknown looks like. To be honest, I think in uh, current games, I think it's red. Like it has a red tint to it. Oh, you guys are saying you want this game in HD? Because I just saw H and I just saw D, so maybe, maybe that'll be upcoming in the next Soul Link. I don't know, maybe. Okay, is there another is there another path we can access here? Not right now. Well, let's, let's go in and talk to this person here. He might want us to catch an unknown to actually do something. That's incredible news. We need to investigate this. I I know that some of the updates are they appear to be much like drawings on the wall there. Hmm. That must mean they're kind of they're some kind of them. I thought maybe I have to catch one. So this capture here, we're going to go and capture an unknown. It's not going to be uh, part of our thing unless you guys vote. No, we're not going to do it. We're not going to do it. Um, let's see. What else can we get ourselves into? I know there's some people you can talk to that give us stuff. I know this guy will give me the... So, he's gonna give us the... Miracle Seed. Okay. Okay, so... I think... I think... I think this is going to be a shorter episode. I know it, it's a very short episode, but I can't really think of much to do. Um, so, I'm, I'm gonna have to pace these episodes out a little bit better to get you guys um, a full episode whenever we en end on a gym. That way you guys can have a full episode to vote and stuff like that. Um, if you guys like this kind of content, hit that like and subscribe subscribe button. And um, if I'm missing anything, let me know. And I th like I said, I think we need to. I want to see if there's if they made some kind of like wireless printing thing for the because they they did all kinds of updates to this game. Um, I doubt they did anything with the wireless printing, but hit that like and subscribe button. And I will see you in t Wednesday's episode. Vote, 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 vote for our next Pokemon, and I will see you then. Have a great day, Poke. Russ out. Peace.